there's going to be a lot of pain this January unless you guys are going to GreenManGaming.com and buying games through our referral link down below. See, ad revenue is on the very, very low for January. There's nothing we could do about that. That's the industry. Head down below. Hello, audience! I dare hear. One of the things I want to try on the channel this year is more, like, mods. Whether it be total conversion mods, mods for games that just add, like, a new gun or something, mods that add new levels, or just full-blown standalone mods. Like this one. This is Portal Stories Mel. This is... I... I think it's sort of like a prelude, uh, like very early aperture back in the 1960s or 40s or whatever the hell Cave Johnson was doing all that crazy stuff and yelling into a microphone, much like I'm doing now. <laughs> Let's start the game. Alright. Oh, wow. Advanced mode! The, the original mod with harder puzzles. <laughs> Oh, 1952. Okay, we'll do, we'll do story mode. Let's let's see. I like how I can jump straight ahead to chapter five. That's weird. Uh, this is a standalone mod. You can find it on Steam. It's free, but you do need the original Portal uh, because that's its base mod, and it takes like the engine and all the assets and stuff from that. It's a free mod, so I'm not expecting too much. That's a cool logo, by the way. That We're off to a good start with that logo. <laughs> oh, we're on a train. What is this? Black Mesa? <laughs> Jacob Anders. Huh? Oh, okay. Oh, shit, hold on. Uh, audio. I guess... Subtitles. Yes. <clears throat> Go. Greetings, astronaut, war hero, or Olympian. My name's Cave Johnson. Quantum tunneling device. Do I have something to show you. Oh. You're here yeah, there was a person. The best the world has People. I don't say that lightly, mind you. So take that as one of the biggest compliments you'll ever get in your life. Okay. You don't know who I Thank am. you. In the beginning, I, I am the best the world has and to and offer. People just don't realize that yet. Military. But I kept dreaming bigger and better. Asbestos you know shower curtain. Okay. Lots of doing, which brought you here. You're writing in the little Michigan town of. Uh, wait. Where are we again? Uh, okay. So, this town doesn't have a name yet, as we're what? about to build it. But that doesn't matter. Point is, you're writing there, and you'll soon be. At Aperture Science Innovators. Woo! We're Sounds still awesome. We're some of this stuff together, but there's a lot of science we can do in the meantime. You've been selected from a large group of candidates for a special test in our temporary testing areas. When the train arrives at the station, head into the town and into the Aperture building. Don't worry, you'll know where it is. You'll get okay. some pre-recorded messages once you're there. Now, get ready to do some science. For now, though, we're going to put on some nice music for you. Oh, okay. This isn't copywritten, right? Otherwise, I gotta go into the game files and replace it with uh, some NCS music. NCS music that won't be invented for another... <laughs> At least... 67 years. <laughs> Look, people! This is new... Ah! I hear, right. I hear gunfire. Oh, I'm aperture central station. <clears throat> Wait. Chris, get over here. How do you spell station? Okay. Think about that for a second. Okay. Does station have an extra O before the I? Alright, listen to me. Pack your things. Because you're fired! Get out of my office. Out. Get out. Out of my office. <clears throat> um... Oh, I can't re-record this. <clears throat> grammar Nazi firing... Grammar Nazi firing someone over a typo. Game <laughs> Johnson really doesn't like to, um... 
re-record over his pre-recorded messages, does he? Ah, ah, it's good coffee. I'm up in the morning, uh, to, uh, record the- Ah! Okay. <laughs> I clicked in and it suddenly came back, which was weird. Hey. Mind your step. Mind your step. Alright, I'll say this. Off to a fan fucking tastic start with the uh, visuals and everything. Science spheres. Is that like the, um. Is that like the ones from Portal 2 where it was like, these spheres are made of asbestos, by the way? Keeps out the rats. <laughs> Let us know if you feel a uh, shortness of breath or your heart stopping, because that's not part of the test. That's asbestos. Repulsion gel. Tastes like science. Do not get covered in it. You don't know what element it is yet, but it's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. Now, as I said before, there's a lot we're still working on. Just watch your step on the way out, and as a reminder, Aperture Science Innovators is not responsible for any injury you sustain. Oh. Up to and including death by exposure to cosmic ray exfoliation. Don't worry, though. We haven't had an accident like that in three days. Manufact vending machine manufacturing. Sorry, make that three minutes. Did something happen with the vending machine manufacturing? Please tell me that. Oh, hey, vending machines. <laughs> the uh, Aperture Cola Repulsion Soda. That doesn't sound good. Speedy Sarsaparilla. Caffeinated decaf. I'll. Hmm? Do I have to put a coin in? Oh. Ten cents. Uh, Cool to three Kelvin. What is that in Fahrenheit? Maybe my Echo Dot knows. Alexa, how warm is three Kelvin? Three Kelvin is minus 270 degrees Celsius. Alexa, how cold is negative 270 degrees Celsius in Fahrenheit? Minus 270 degrees Celsius is minus 454 degrees Fahrenheit. That's really fucking cold. <laughs> okay. Out of service. Oh no! The toilets don't work. Aperture subway system. Aperture! I was always more of an aperture person myself. Like in the competition between Here Black Mesa and others, we love to give back to the community. Cars! So, instead of just giving back, achievements! We made our own cool! Community. Entirely made out of aperture science malleable concrete on top of the salt mines. And that's exactly why you shouldn't touch the walls or stomp your feet either. <clears throat> that's thing we need is to touch up a dent in the wall because someone was too hands on. Okay. Sure. Salt mines. It's like rock salt. I got a rock salt lamp. Aperture science innovators. Innovators, not innovations. Hmm. I can hear a little noise when I hit. Is that supposed to be like the portal gun? Eh. It's a free mod. Can't be too perfect. <laughs> There's the moon! A lot of people talk about the man in the moon, but, this is, but like all the other co countries on the planet talk about the rabbit in the moon. I'm starting to see that more, rather than the man in the moon. Man in the moon is fucking stupid. Like interiors. This is more than we got in City 17. Are there people in there? Guess not. I don't know what time it is. I can't go in here either. I can't even see the front door. Apartments! Dude, these... Th Dude! Look, they got interiors and everything. Dude, there's a... Someone put a lot of work into this. <laughs> uh, welcome, test subjects. <laughs> I told you it was easy to find. You found it faster than... Uh, any test subjects on record. <clears throat> on record? Uh, that's not good. <clears throat> Just head through the door on the right to the elevator. You'll know where to go. 
Um, door on the right. Shit, fuck. <laughs> That's left, stupid! <laughs> uh. Local entrepreneur buys salt mine. The future is here, and it's under the Earth's crust, says Science Maverick. Top 100 applied science companies. After science number two! Yeah, guess, wonder who was number one. Best new science company, Aperture Science. Cool. Shower curtain salesman of 1943. <laughs> Cave Johnson, shower curtain salesman of 1943. Aperture fixtures. Good for him. Good for him. Look, there are dudes in there. Guy looks. Well, he's moving, so he's not dead, but he looks tired. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Look at this. Science and technology. Is events like this universe's equivalent of life? Oh, wait, what's that say? The presentation here is fan fucking tastic. So at first, I wanted to put in a long flight of stairs that spiraled down through the old salt mines down here. Okay. That subject's a great view of the place. But no! The zoning boards on my bean counters said that's why they invented elevators. So, when someone in a wheelchair threatened to sue, my former boys chicken out of me and built this elevator to go to our temporary offices. I'm well. still working on those stairs, and those guys are working on getting new jobs. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, though, the stairs aren't ready, so get on that stupid elevator. <laughs> uh, Okay. <laughs> I wanted a spiral staircase, but they wanted a damn elevator. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know why it blacks out like that. Maybe to load something. Here at Aperture, we're always trying to push the boundaries of science that little bit more. That's oh. why we're taking on this new project. When the bean counters told me not to buy a salt mine and do all this science, the first thing they said was, No, there's too much space. You can't suspend something over nothing and pray that a test can happen in thin air. <laughs> well, thanks to some use of the old calculator between the ears and a generous helping of the you're fired stamp, I came up <laughs> with a final solution to that. If you can't anchor something in thin air, why bother trying to make it in the air in the first place? I came up with this. Yeah? Oh, Introducing cool. the Aperture Science Innovator's Suspended Testing Sphere. Each sphere is suspended in the air, anchored to the walls by concrete and steel lattice rebar. They Neat. seem like they float in the air, but in fact, they don't. Plus, we can keep building above them, onward and upward. This salt mine here can take at least ten of these bad boys per shaft. Nine shafts, <laughs> ninety tests. We can test whatever we want to, and beat that other company in the ground. Black Mason. Those guys can kiss my back. Anyway, the bean counters cry like babies when they saw the cost of these things. Yeah, down with Black Mesa! I pay the bills, I make the decisions around here, and I hire a fire as I please. Now, the first of these spheres won't be ready for a few more months, so you'll be participating in one of our smaller tests. The Aperture Science Innovator's Short-Term Relaxation Vault. Okay. Sounds good. Short-term relaxation vault. <laughs> it's just a, it's just a room, a locked room with a Zen garden in it. Maybe a koi pond. <laughs> yeah, sounds quite nice. Look at this, is pretty cool. The fucking presentation of this is spot fucking on. How many people worked on this? I don't know. 89. When you get to the offices, mm. I'll tell you a bit more. This test should be real easy for you, though. Just get inside one of the Aperture Science Innovator's short-term relaxation vaults and lie in a bed. You'll feel yourself fall asleep quickly. Don't worry, though. Our science boys will get you out shortly. You'll only be out for a few minutes. Uh, an hour at most if something goes wrong. Uh. <clears throat> Don't worry. We've got everything under control. You'll be making science, and you won't have to do a thing. Who's the winner here? You are. Neat! 
<laughs> How long until something goes wrong? Please keep your legs inside the elevator. I mean, yeah, I'll try. <laughs> can't really, uh... Can't really get my legs out unless I climb over something. How deep are we going? Uh, it looks like we're stopping here. Yep. Okay. It's a lot of loading screens, though. That's the one downside. It's not that big a downside, so it's not that bad. <laughs> so, okay. as I said on the last pre-recorded message, you'll be heading into an Aperture Science interview Ooh. with short-term relaxation fault for a quick, deep sleep. And then you're done. That's why we brought you here at night. You're most <laughs> likely a walking zombie. That'll give us the best results. But just remember, don't sleep too long. This isn't a bed and breakfast. And if you decide to stay tonight, I'm charging you rent for the next year. We'll have a bed ready for you. Just follow the testing area signs and go to bed. Don't mind the turrets. They're firing blanks. At least that's what Crazy Harry told me. Huh? <clears throat> Got six signs, boys. Disappear, is it? You got trees growing down. This is fucking fan fucking tastic looking. And this is on the uh steam pipe engine, I believe. Which isn't a overly fantastic engine. It's a more stable engine than the source engine. But then again, the source engine <laughs> coders call it the Tower of Duct Tape. <laughs> No, fan fucking tastic presentation. Wow. I've been charged games that look worse than this. There are free mods out there that'll look worse than this, but there are full price games that look worse than this as well. Oh, wait, there's a visual glitch for you. The, uh, these lamp posts right here. <laughs> Okay, I have lower standards for uh, free mods. Um, freaking uh, what's it called? Don't worry, those toys won't kill you. The safety on their guns is on. Had some lab boys shut them down. Crazy Harry likes me. Oh. <laughs> ah, this door opens. Ah. This looks uh, this looks good. Um. If you're hearing this message, you're at the sleeping chamber. Yay! Carolyn, is the test ready? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. Cave Johnson! Then you're good to go. Step into the chamber and get into the bed. <coughs> Our lab boys will take care of the rest. Yeah, I... I'm not... I'm not hearing... that voice... on that face. <laughs> it sounds like he's trying to do an impersonation. Like he's trying to put on a deeper voice. Or something. Captain Sulu. <laughs> Alright. Sleep! Nice hands, I, I guess. Full cutscenes. Interesting. Okay. Good night. So I just, just sit here, I guess. Sipping my coffee and twiddling my thumbs. <laughs> yes. Oh crap, police sirens. What did I do? Did I get super drunk last night again? And freaking look, it wasn't me, okay? That damn police officer was pulling over every car on that sidewalk. Hmm? Is a is is this thing on? Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Oh, right, you can't answer. Uh, uh, I'm so sorry, astronaut, Olympian. Or war hero, there was a slight problem with the test. Don't worry though, oh. you got shot okay. Nothing's different, nothing's changed. Just uh, head out of the chamber, I'll tell you a bit more out there. Really? Because it looks like there's a stain on the wall that wasn't there before. Duh! What the hell? 
Door's not very stable. Don't worry about the heights. Had a few of huh? scientists make what's called long fall boots. Uh, I mean, aperture science innovators, long fall boots. <laughs> that was easier to think of than I thought. Uh, okay, uh. I don't know when. I don't know when. I don't know when you put those on my feet, but okay. Hey. Pick that yellow device up. Don't worry, oh. it's not hazardous. I've had the scientists leave you a new device to help you. Yeah, that's right. A new test. Congratulations. You can huh? test something else now. Double the experiments for you. Ooh. Old reliable. The first a ash pod to have three healthy surviving users. <laughs> so is this... Ah, oh, check it out! They actually have a, like a different portal gun. Ah. It glows with the might of a thousand portal guns! There's an open door <laughs> nearby. Should take you out of the building. You'll need that new test to move around. But don't worry though, we built the building like Cool. This. <laughs> uh, don't worry about that. It's just huh? uh, a new drilling test we're doing down below. Yeah, <laughs> to get the salt mines deeper. To get oh, the okay. Spirits in. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Just ignore that. So like, uh, ah, there we go. Now where do I put the blue one? Water! Yay! Aperture science innovators! Is that like a... I thought it was aperture science innovations. I need to go take... Ah, hey, up there! Yeah, that'll work. Okay. Yep. Nice. Remember, alert your supervisor if you see an OSHA inspector, a FEMA coordinator, de de Department of Energy inspector, an ordinary police officer, a GAO accountant, a journalist, an undercover police officer, a public works inspector, nuclear regulatory commissioner, MSHA mine inspector, a commissioner, ATF, FBI, a U.S. Marshal, or... Let's see, see what they didn't put on in here was an IRS tax collector. You know why they didn't put it on there? Because you have to avoid those guys anyway. You, 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 that just goes without saying. You don't need a reminder of that. There's a paper clip on the end of this. That can't be good. Can I, hey, can I, uh, yes. So does that mean... Hey! It's Cave Johnson! <laughs> so, can I just... Yep. Alright. See, I know my way around a portal gun. Don't mind all this, too. We just had, uh, earthquakes. Lots of earthquakes. Oh? Yeah. Yeah, you get lots of those here in Michigan. Alexa, does Michigan get earthquakes? Sorry, I don't know that. Uh, Great. I'm gonna have to take his word for it. <laughs> uh, um, I think Michigan is known for fracking, which is a form of These mining. Earthquakes uh, even shook up time a bit. Some huh? from the future got here. Yeah, that's how it's here. Uh, don't worry, it's still 1952. Adlai Stevenson is still president. Alexa, who was president in 1952? Right, so, the earthquakes. Kind of did some... In 1952, Harry S. Truman was U.S. president. Fucking liar! <laughs> uh, but who the hell is Adley Stevenson? Alexa, Wikipedia Adley Stevenson. Sorry, what would you like to look up on Wikipedia? Adley Stevenson. Adlai Ewing Stevenson II was an American lawyer, politician, and diplomat, noted for his intellectual demeanor, eloquent public speaking, and promotion of progressive causes in the Democratic Party. You can ask me to read more from Wikipedia. Okay, so it never said he was president. Are these turrets live? I... There's gotta be something Look at you can use me. to launch yourself over the door. Huh? There has to be another way out. So what, the door doesn't work? I never actually did try the door, did I? Ah, uh, of course the door's not gonna work. Let's try upstairs. I never did go upstairs. 
the subject waiting area. Uh, okay. Best new science company. I think they were putting in new, uh, flooring or some shit. Ah! That's gotta be something, right? Hmm. There's an emergency. Oh, no, wait, I was just in there. Yeah, that's where I shot the portal, and that's the hall. That's the painting of Cave Johnson. And there's the pipe that's leaking. <laughs> no, your allergens. Pollen, animal dander, plastics, and antimatter. <sighs> yeah, you really gotta look out for that antimatter. Okay, so there must be something I can do in here. Ah! Propulsion gel. Let's take a look here. Ah. Guess that activates the thingy. Okay. Now what? That's, that doesn't help me unless it was repulsion gel. It, wait, can I put a portal there? I can. Now I can do my favorite thing of the whole game. Paint a tur- What? Here, just a sec. Paint a turret orange. Well, that's not working. Here, are you guys the- Ah! Yes! 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 You guys are very, very live. Are you live too? Ow! Yes! Okay, you are very live. I like that they have Tommy guns on them. <laughs> Do not tip over. All right, so just a second. Now what I could do is, uh, oh, I gotta get back up there. The presentation in this game is really fucking great. Like, I really like the presentation. Presentation is a big thing for me. For a, a free mod, nonetheless? Wow. Well done. All right, now what I should be able to do is Hey, you're gonna come with me. Your name is now Jared. Let's go, Jared! Woo! Ow! I know, things <laughs> might look different than what you're used to, but uh, while you were spending that little time sleeping, we had some, some uh, aperture science nanomachines come in and build all this stuff. Including yeah, the acid? Assets. They're quick little guys. Faster than any science guy I got. Okay. So, uh, is this... Uh, sorry, Jared, I'm afraid you have to die now. Beyond that door is one of the new testing tracks. Totally, completely new. Get okay. through it and head to the first testing sphere. I'll let you know more there. Alright. I guess. Um... Now, I just want to make sure you know something before you go any further. We yeah. have these new inventions called emancipation grids in place to prevent objects from moving around to other tests. Now, some guy decided that it would be a good idea to make ones that prevent people from going through and installed one where people needed to go through. Well, you have an accent. So can I, uh, uh hey, office. <sighs> ah, here we go. Turn the power off, you can easily turn it back on. That switch isn't like the rest of them. The others trip a circuit breaker that causes an entire part of the facility's power grid to blow up. So remember, the one in here is good. All others, bad. Okay. So don't I pull think these the switch. Were designed for two people. Maybe your uh, new test can help. What is that? Is that a Borealis life ring? <laughs> Did you just flip a Borealis life ring? backwards and say, ah, that's good, and put it there. <laughs> In the event of flooding, seek air pockets. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> Seal oh, 01. Right, I think I got an idea. Put a portal here. And is there somewhere I can put, I think right here. I like that that X isn't responding to the lighting. All right. Because I think I need power in order to turn those switches. Okay. Remember, 
You can always turn the power on or off again. Like, I can't walk through that. Ah, uh, yes, here we go. And then... Because I noticed the, uh, timer. Oh, sh I... Yeah, shut up! <laughs> I put it in the wrong portal! There we go. Alright. How do I get down there without getting hurt? I mean, I got the log fall boots, but... Is it flooded down there? Uh, can I jump over this? No. There's somewhere I can throw a portal in there. No. Ah. Oh, great, the thing came back. So I'm stuck in here. At least until I find a way out. Ah! There we go. <laughs> All right, let's figure this out. Whoa, what the hell was that? It was like a, whoa. What is that? It's like a laser beam. Anyone else seen that? Huh. <laughs> the hell is that? Is that like an elevator or something? Or a way down would be preferable. There's a door there. I don't know if I can reach it. Oh, wait, there's a vent. I can climb up onto the train car. Um, anything else in the office? Some broken glass up there. Might be relevant. There's a door here. Oh. Like, I always feel a great bit of hostility towards a door when it goes Ehh! or something along those lines. But clearly I have to be in there, so I'm gonna try firing portals at the walls and I'm throwing science at the wall here and see to see what sticks. No idea what it'll do. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Just a second. There we are. Okay. Back on track. There's a box here. I can't pick it up. Can't pick that box up either. No. <laughs> the doors here hate me. Uh, um... What else is there? Oh wait, can I get up there? Aha! Looking for white walls. The new testing track is just through here. Okay. New testing track. Uh, you got the emancipation grid in here. Ah! Fucking bird! 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 Kill it! It's evil! <laughs> oh, that's meant to happen. Just to test your, uh, reflexes. You know, after your short sleep. Shut up. <laughs> okay. I think we all know what's going on. Ooh, I can hear it. Nice job on the sounds. Uh, can I? Mm, uh, this is precarious? Okay. <sighs> precarious. Precarious as hell! And hell is very precarious. All right, first test, here we go. We're like, oh, so far into this. And we're finally getting to our first test. Test me! Ah! I like that! Eyeballs! Bravo Volta, the, hold on. Fit, testing track, yes, fit. You'll need a portal device to get through. Uh, uh, sorry, I, I meant a portable quantum tunneling device. I, look, it's in your hands right now. Uh, yeah. The scientists did their job. You'll do fine. Okay. So, we got some uh, repulsion gel and we got some water. It's very repulsing. Alright. 
So, I learned this, uh, I learned this trick from, uh, playing the original Portal. The, the, the best thing to do is to just spread this crap around as much as you can. <laughs> that's what I, that's how I solved the, um, the white gel puzzle. It was gonna be the purple gel that allows that allowed you to walk on walls. But then things got real complicated. What's this button do? It gives me a box! How do I get the box? I need to find a way to get the box. Ah! Again, you just gotta spread this crap around as much as you can. Repulsing, isn't it? <laughs> All right, I think I can make that jump. Can I save? I think I'm saving. All right, boom. Got the box. Uh, tell you what, let me tell you what we could just do. All right, got through that easily. Uh, just put that right there to keep it clean. Uh, the red is bad. We must avoid the red. All right, what do we do from here? Is there something I missed over here? I think, I feel like there's something I missed over here. Uh, here. This is a trick that I picked up playing uh, community maps. Check it out. Eventually, it just stops spitting it out. And it's like, all right, you got enough. The game literally cannot load anymore. So now, boing. What's this button do? Hey, it's not on a timer, right? Wait, we need to be sure. So really, shutting that down doesn't really... Oh. Oh, wait. Yes, it does. It helps us immensely. Wait. Hold on. Dip. Dip. Okay. So now... I think... Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, bear with me on this. Um, what we're gonna do is, uh, s s the slam jam and jammy jam. Tell you what, put the blue here. The water. Not the blue, the, 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 the water is blue, but shut up, you know what I mean. The get rid of, the, the giddy ridy of e gel. It's basically just water. <laughs> Alright, so we don't have enough jump height here. Oh, wait, wait. Uh, is there a way for us to get more height? Yes. There is. And no one's gonna like it. <laughs> Only because I don't like it. Alright, so I've done that. I've done terrible things here, people. <laughs> Just make sure there's enough of it on that corner. Okay. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take this box. We're gonna do what we were doing before, jumping and jumping up and down, up and down and all around the pit. Put the box there. Make sure the box stays there. Okay. Stop spitting blue stuff everywhere. All right, we're gonna experiment with this box. Boing! And it's dead. Uh, of course it is. <sighs> I'll go get another one. All right, so that box was, uh, 
That box was just a test. I was testing you, Aperture Science. <laughs> are you, are you smart enough to test these t test chambers? <laughs> I was testing your test chambers. All right, I don't like jumping through portals with boxes, so. Okay. I'm pretty sure that's what you you expected to happen. Now everything about this test is lead line, according to my 1950s notes here in okay. my 1950s filing cabinet. It says it's harmful to humans. Uh, I mean, not harmful to humans. You'll be okay, perfectly fine, nothing to worry about. Oh, and uh, don't worry about the boxes. We got a ton backstocked ready for this kind of thing. Throw them at the wall. Is it? Damn it. Repeat. Useless little things. Made them in an hour. Oh, yeah? Okay, thanks, Mr. Johnson. Uh, can I... Get any particular amount of height from this? Not particularly, no. <laughs> Absolutely not, no. I cannot. We do have a lot of portal surfaces, though. All of them on the floor. Uh, we can't go that way. We'll fall out of the science sphere. There's a window here. I think that might have something to do with it. No, it doesn't. Of course it doesn't. Uh. Okay, um, wait. This grating here is... No. Nothing. What about this wall? It's suspicious. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to think of a way that I can easily get to the, uh, that piston, but it's not coming to me. Ugh! Yeah, now that's impossible. Okay. We've a step. Wait, there's a button. Oh, you almost fell in. The you almost fell. You almost got emancipated. Oh wait, now I can't get the button off. He's at least not easily. Um. Maybe I can push it somehow. thought there was a hidden portal surface. There wasn't! Yeah. Oh great, now the box is up there. That's the opposite of where it needs to be. <laughs> It needs to be down here. Try moving it closer. Maybe I can grab it. I cannot. Okay. At least I tried. Uh, okay. I've made a decision. I've decided we need to science the crap out of this box. So here we go. Science the crap out of it! That was incredibly disappointing. Wait, that hit the button. Now we have another box. A second box. Ooh, that doesn't help me at all. Thank you for another box. Okay, um... Well, now I need to figure out how to get... The... Well, I still need to figure out how to get it off the button! Alright, let me think. There isn't anything above the button, so...
Here, doesn't mean. Ugh. Fuck you! Place it, like, like on the very edge of the, the very edge of the. Yep. Okay, it's quite impossible. Quite impossible. That is what I have deduced. Ugh. The problem now is we can't use portal. They, these are actually hard. Okay, these are actually hard. Of course, there's some easy solution that I'm not seeing, and someone in the comments is screaming at me right about now. Ugh. I have an idea. If I could somehow... I don't have an idea. Fuck! Alright, you guys are gonna love this, but I think the solution to this was so blatantly stupid and convoluted that I'd never be able to figure it out. Alright, I've been sciencing like crazy the past few minutes. Here we go. There we are. Oh wait. Oh, I don't have a box. I just gave it to... I just gave it to the never-ending... Wait. Ha-ha! <laughs> You're not dead. That means that high toxicity lead didn't get in the air and... Uh, I mean, great job, astronauts, Olympian, or war hero. You yes. really are a merit to science. Or something like that. J just remember the Nuremberg Olympics. Nuremberg Olymp... Yeah, sure. Sure! Voice. Who I'm... 65.5% sure is not Cave Johnson. It's always 65.5% with me. Yes, I know. It's... Weird. And... Well, yes, it's weird. I don't want... Mm. Let's do one more. This test uses the new Aperture Science Innovator's propulsion gel. But okay. it allows you to... No, wait. Hold on. This record said they didn't make that until the 70s. Never you mind that. Just, uh, solve science. Yes. Science. Let's go with that assumption. Eh. All right, once again, spray it everywhere. Everywhere, up and down, all around, everybody hit the ground, walls. All the walls. Everywhere I can paint the walls orange. I need more! MORE! There we go. More! More! Mm. Yes! Good, 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 good. Where's that going? Nowhere! It's going nowhere. Uh, here we go! And more! Any more? Look, wait, there's a blue nozzle right there. Please, do not be alarmed. We are about to extend the nozzle. <laughs> Please, do not look away from the nozzle. Alright, I got another idea for the nozzle. We need blue gel in there because I think I'm going to need a box. Right? That's enough. Is there any... Uh, just put it there. And the orange one up there. Let me just jump up there. Yep. Just jump up th there. We go. Okay. Alright. Now where are we going? I've built myself a freaking runway. This and that. 
That'll work. There we go. All right. I have no idea if this is gonna work, but let's find out. Woo! Oh god. Yeah, it works good. Okay. Uh, now I need to get up higher. Okay. Down we go. Now what? Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Alright, put the orange there. I have to build a very long runway. Somehow. Actually, uh, somehow. Okay, I need to get back over there, because that's the runway that I built, and then I have to jump across. Can I even make it back home? Can I shoot a portal from, uh... I think just barely I might be able to do it. Oh, wait. I only have two portals. Uh... I messed up a little bit. And I need this box. I have funny ideas. They might be funny, they might be pointless, they might actually be what saves us all. I need this. Alright. Now... I could just run straight over there, so... Boom! Skip! Skip! Alright. One more time! Do that. And... Start running! I think I might be able to jump that... No. No, I can't. Try this. Yeah! Damn it. Uh... It's a good idea, though. Is there any way that I can, uh... Like, my thinking here is that I'm able, somehow able to make it up, uh, make it up there without any portals. Just try something real quick. Hope to God it doesn't hit that box. Okay. It looks like I could just barely hit that. Alright. Shut the gel off. We might need this box. Ah! We do need the box. I did it! Oh God, there's another right. one. Oh, hold up a second, Mel. I don't think you're huh? that stupid that you're going to fall for this anymore. I'll be blunt now. I'm not Cave Johnson. Oh. This isn't the 1950s. Everyone you knew and loved is dead. And now you're stuck here in Aperture Science, done with oh. the crash. Like me. After everyone left because of that boat. Oh no! Which the I'm boat! Sure you already knew, but, uh, whatever. However, I can get us out of here. If you're willing to let a voice in the sky who just told you he was lying the entire time he was talking to you control nearly every movement you make. I'll try this. Is that okay? Boom. Oh. <laughs> I, I, I'll just take your silence as a yes. Oh, right. You can't answer me. Uh, Give me the box. Uh, I know what to do with it now. Do what I say, and you'll be fine. Turn off okay. these emancipa em emancipation fields. All right. Portal here. And then... Portal. Just make sure you get it all over that. Yes, good. 
that I made you something. <laughs> Just lather it all over there. Just throw this junk anywhere. Just button do what I think it does. Because I think it shuts off the emancipation grids. Wait. Yeah, I might be able to do something with that. Okay. Let's try this again. Alright. Where was I? Ah, oh, yes. Alright. Fire the box! Oh, wait, I have to sit here. Did I make it through? Yeah, I think it made it through. We'll find out in just a second. Yes, it made it. Okay. Alright, now, take this, throw it here. Now we don't have that to, now we don't have that one to worry about. Which means we can, is there a place I can throw a portal down? No. Not down there, at least. Actually, I'm not entirely sure I need that, need that one, go wait. I see where we're going with this. Portal, portal. Uh, then we put the blue here. Boom. Out of wait. And across it goes. Oh, wait. Wait, now I can't. Mm. This is an issue, isn't it? Ow! Go jump off a cliff! I mean, this doesn't help. <laughs> All right, so somehow I need to get that ema that emancipation grid off. Actually, I might be able to just really. Yeah, no, I need a box. All right, let's start with you. So we know what this one does. That allows me to do that the things oh so many wonderful things I just need to find a way to destroy the box also I need to find a way to turn off the emancipation grid emancipation grid. was that does that button up there do anything else like you know dis that disables the emancipation grid. okay I have to be standing here as the as the box comes flying towards me which means somehow I need to be able to hit that button wait there's a thing here all right hold on get me some portals some repulsion gel all right now that I got that wait no put that back we're just gonna do this. We're just gonna go straight there. In you go, you naughty box! There we go. The solution was simple. Okay. That's Portal Stories Mel. Uh, look for it on Steam. It's free. Uh, you do need to own, uh, Portal 2 in order to get it to run, though. But, yeah, this is awesome! The puzzles are actually pretty good, the presentation is great, that's an awesome-looking custom portal gun. It's an all-around very, very well-put-together game. I, I recommend this, and even then, it's free! So, about <laughs> before... You can get why I said all that, right? No. I'd rather not have my one chance of escape have a panic attack and die on me after years of being suspended in a faulty relaxation vault. What? Which could be a real possibility, because as my records show, the old test could cause heart attacks after small exposure to the chemicals. What? And you were pumped full of them. So, let's all just take a breath and start over. My name's Virgil. I'm a core from up in the enrichment center. Okay. Before you even think of asking, yes, there is a building above you, and yes, I came from it. I'm not crazy. 
Don't be too alarmed, though. A lot's changed since you got put on ice. Mm-hmm. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys! And I'll see you in the next video. Oh, if you'll excuse me, I have to science the shit out of everything in this building. So much science to be done. And blue stuff. Oh, so much blue stuff. Boing! Button. Door. Science! Oh. The device has been out of time.